This one you have to push a little to get in the car. Come on, Zazu, let's go. Get in, let's go. Let's go home, Zazu. Zazu, let's go. Zazu, get in. Get in. Good boy. And over here, this one wants to just get in the car. No matter what. Come on, come on. Let's go and get in. Good job. You see the difference between these two right here? No matter how cold it is. For these two little munchkins, we have to sit outside. They're tired after their long hike. Zazu! Zazu! Wally! Wally! Nope. He's watching the leaves fall. So this is the difference between a lab and a pointer. Zazu is staring at the food. Waiting for someone to drop something while the pointer is just sleeping. Yes, we spoil them and that's why there's like a blanket on the floor. So what we're trying to do over here is Crick, Green, Wally. We have these treats here and we're going to use the clicker and put some treats in his crate so that he feels like the crate is his home. It's nice and safe. He has been squealing and crying a little bit. We have this crate in our room so that he doesn't feel alone. But we haven't had him sleep in the bed like Zazu over here. The privileges of this little good boy. Good boy are you. So, yep. We're trying to train him with those treats. Let's see how he does. I was no. like, let Zazu. me go get it. No, no, Zazu, Zazu, get back. Zazu, come up here. Get back. Get up. No, no, no. Oh, Zazu. Get up there. Zazu. Zazu. So this was actually Zazu's crate before. Maybe that's why he just wants to get in there. Sometimes he does when Wally's not inside. Get, get up there. But, yep. Zazu does feel like Wally's taking over a lot of his stuff. So he's still adjusting. So there you go, he went inside the crate, he put in the treats, now he knows the crate is where he gets treats. So he's not crying right now or squealing, which he usually does, he doesn't like going in the crate. So looks like he's lying down and comfortable already. But we're just gonna stay over here and see if he's doing fine. Now when he gets inside and he's not squealing oh he's all relaxed now yeah are you relaxed good boy so he thinks the crate is a positive thing that's what we want him to feel like good boy. Good boy. so that clicker good boy. for good behavior good and that treat for being such a good boy so we started with a minute or two leaving him in the crate we slowly increased it by three or four minutes and looks like he's sleeping i mean he's relaxed it's more than four minutes now his was like oh, i got this already you got his head down yep good boy wally So this time we did not put any treats in there, he just went in, but again, he's much more relaxed, no crying, no squealing. So another thing is we don't want to open or speak to him when he's crying or squealing. It's when he quiets down or he's much calmer, that's when we want to open the door or try to say something to him otherwise he'll try to get our attention by trying to squeal or cry that's what they want our attention so 